In this video, I'm going to show you how to add music to your Prezi. Hey everyone, this is Dave from biztoolschool.com with another Prezi video tutorial. In this video, we're going to learn how to jazz up your Prezi with sound and music. Alright, let's jump right into it. Prezi lets you add sound to your presentations in one of two ways. The first way is to add a background track that will be played for the duration of your Prezi. To do this, open or create a new Prezi and then click on the insert menu at the top of the page. Select add background music from the list. Now you'll be prompted to upload an audio file from your computer. Once you've selected your audio file and started the upload, you'll see a small bar on the left side of the application window showing the upload progress. You can cancel at any time and you'll know that the upload is complete when you see a small music track indicator appearing. From this little track indicator, you can play back your music or delete it. You can also skip around by clicking on the timeline. When you want to close this window, just click Done. You can always reopen the playback window by clicking on the track title again. If you need to change the background music, no problem. Just return to the insert menu at the top of the screen and select replace background music. You'll be prompted to select a new audio file to upload. Now your project is all set with its background track. When you switch to presentation mode, Prezi will start playing the background music as soon as you start the presentation. Prezi will also automatically loop the background track. So if you're still in the middle of your presentation, don't worry, you'll still have background music playing. In addition to letting you add a single background track, Prezi also lets you add audio to the individual steps in your presentation path. This feature allows you to add voiceover audio, a sound effect, or any other type of audio that will be triggered at any point in your presentation. To do this, you simply select the path point where you want your voiceover audio to be played. Then you go to the insert menu and select add voiceover for that path point. As before, you'll be prompted to select an audio file from your computer and upload it. Once the file is uploaded, you can play it back or delete it if necessary. You'll also be able to see which path points have associated audio files since they'll appear at the top of the path point thumbnail in the left panel here. Just a side note, Prezi calls this feature voiceover audio, but really you can add any kind of audio you want, sound effect, music, whatever. It doesn't have to be strictly voiceover. Now, when you switch to presentation mode, Prezi will play the audio voiceover for a path point when you trigger that path point in the presentation. Note that the playback for the path audio is not looped. You'll hear the voiceover audio a single time. However, if you go backwards in your Prezi and then go forwards again and trigger a path point with audio, that voiceover audio will play again. I'm going to add one more sound effect to this example for you and then I'm going to show you the playback for both background and voiceover audio. Alright, now our Prezi has a background track and some voiceover audio effects. Let's see how it all fits together when we run the Prezi in presentation mode. So there you have it, two ways to add audio to Prezi to really jazz up your presentations and take them to the next level. As always, if you have any questions, be sure to post them in the comments or email me at papa at biztoolschool.com and be sure to check out my other Prezi video tutorials. Thank you.